Hello and welcome, this is your Funky Honky with Let's Play Mass Effect 2 Blind, episode 12. In this one, before I forget, I'm going to level up. Operative. Why'd that boost my Renegade and Paragon? It's weird. How much does that cost? Four. Okay. Well, uh, sure, let's get cryo ammo as well, because why not? Wait, hold on, let's... Can I level up the rest of the squad from here? No, only when we leave. Okay, that's fine. Alright, um... Hi. How is our newest Turian crew member doing? His injuries looked painful. He's tough. He's a soldier. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. True. How may I help you, Commander? Out of crew. Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? Nope. That'll be all. Yes, Commander. Alright, let's go find Garrus. Um, I can't remember which floor he's on. Eh, let's talk with the whole crew. You're cool. Shepard, how can I help? Are there any medical concerns I should be aware of on the team? Cerberus personnel in excellent condition. No squad concerns to report. Always some matters, but nothing affecting immediate mission. That's good. How about you? You got a minute to talk? Not now. Working on collector data. Have ruled out artificially intelligent virus. Unless it's very intelligent. And toying with me. Hmm. Tests. Anything else? Oh, nope. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Good. That's going to take a lot of platinum. Sure, let's upgrade my sniper rifle. Boosh. Boosh. Look, blowing things up. Oh, okay. Any good prototypes? I'm not going to spend money on that because you don't. Um... No, I'm, I'm, I'm content with my grenade launcher. Um, I never use... Well, no, because it, it'll help. Sure. Even more med gel capacity. Why not? Not that I ever need to use it, but what the hell. Okay. Um, armory, this is where that dude hangs out. Hi. Commander, can I help you with something? Maybe. I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. If you want, Commander. Cerberus has ranks, but it's not the Alliance. No rules about fraternization. Your boat, your call. You want to get friendly with everyone? That's your business. How's that supposed to be? Relax, mean? Jacob. I'm just interested in what makes you tick. Anyone else said that, I'd walk away. Most Cerberus people try to play like the elusive man, hiding bullshit behind a smile. I don't you? smile. I like what I've seen. I'll give you a shot. What do you want to know? Any family? Anyone waiting for you back home? Only child and no extended family. Never settled down. Didn't seem fair with this job. But you can't miss what you never had. So, uh, yeah, what's, that? what's the deal with you and Miranda? I know you and Miranda work together. I got the impression it might have been more than that. It got a little close. Then it got really far apart. The rest isn't your business, Commander. Oh, yeah? Anything that could affect the ship or the mission is my business. I need to know you two won't be a problem. Now you sound like Cerberus. It's not an issue. It was a long time ago. That's the end of it. All right. I think that's enough talking. I appreciate your interest, Commander. I appreciate you dropping it, too. Fine. Where's Garrus again? Oh wait, I have fish now! Fishies! Hello fishies! Oh, I thought I, I got like a hamster or something. Space hamster! Woohoo! And ships. And... 
Trappy space music. Okay, so anyway. Garrus! Oh, I haven't talked to... I don't think I've talked to the, uh... The, um... The, 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 the cook. Since I, uh... Got the new food. Maybe I already have, I'm not sure. Hi. Commander, those provisions you provided were perfect. I owe you. I've already thrown together some of my calamari gumbo. Here, try a bite. All right. Personally, I don't like calamari. Truth told, it's based on an Asari recipe. Seems a little cannibalistic to me with their tentacle heads and all, but they ain't no good grub. Anyway, thanks again. You really came through. My pleasure. Garrus. Shepard, need me for something? Let's talk. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. All right. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. But I just did, and you said no. Jerk. Jog! Rupert, there's something different with tonight's meal. Seems like you put in more food and less ass. Yeah, yeah, keep talking. Miranda doesn't have anything to talk about. Alright, let's go and, um, I guess recruit another crew member. Because why not? That seems to be what I'm busy doing. No, oh, let's... Who knows, maybe we'll find while we're in the system. Come on, come on. Enter orbit. Start the scanner. Hello, Platinum. Among other things. Yes, I know to press left mouse. I'm waiting until I find the right spot. That'll do. Um, yeah. Yeah. Wait, I didn't want to. Damn it. Uh, be consistent! Let's check out this little spec. Tiny little thing. Should be easy enough to scan being this small. Right there. Well 
launched. Right there. Launching probe. Nothing, 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 nothing. Wait, right. a little bit there. Only a little bit. Only a little bit. Oh, 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 oh. Hold on, hold on. Right there. Probe away. Say, this is a lot more fun than I thought. I thought that this would get tedious quick, but it's actually kind of fun. Oh, wait, wait, what did we say there? Oh, hello. Hello! Probe away. And there. Probe launched. Pro. Okay, that's enough. I think that's... Oh, nope, there's one more planet. Scan! Rich, huh? Kinda like me. Launched. You know, because that's my name. I'm not trying to say I'm wealthy or anything, because I'm definitely. Oh, hello! Because I'm definitely not. <laughs> Head up the fuel depot next, get some more probes. Probe launched. Probe launched. Rich. Probe away. Probe launched. I'm assuming that when it starts ticking, that means X marks the spot. Probe away. Launching probe. <laughs> it's all. It was rich. Now it's only down to now it's down to moderate. <laughs> I've mined the shit out of this place. Okay, that'll do. Alright, let's get over the fuel depot. I don't think I need fuel. But I definitely need probes. And now... Let's overshoot the mass relay and jump somewhere else. 
Yes, let's recruit the convict. Pew! Let's check this place out first. I really need... I really want platinum. Oh, oh. Speak, oh, the devil. out my iridium at this rate. It was kind of a joke, but I think I might be right. Probe away. Guess uh, 25 grand is the most you can have. Okay, well it's down to poor, so let's get out. And I'm sure that, uh, I'm sure that me Scanning planets is absolutely fascinating for you folks, so uh, let's just go ahead and um, not. Maybe I'll do it on my own time. Owned by the Tory. Blue sun. What is with the blue suns? They're fucking everywhere. I'm just, I'm really looking forward to ship-to-ship -ship combat. I think that could be really cool. As long as it's done right. Yes! Oh wait, I forgot to open up the Krogan! You don't have anything you can buy. You do, though! Alright, let's go. Yeah, that's right. Your death has come. I'll shoot you in the face with my heavy pistol and my recently upgraded submachine gun. Oh, you're gonna be uh, you're gonna be civil about this. Hi. Welcome to the Purgatory, Shepard. Your package is being prepped, and you can claim it shortly. As this is a high security vessel, you need to relinquish your weapons before we proceed. Go to hell. I'll relinquish one bullet. Where do you want it? Everyone stand down. Commander, I'm Warden Kiro, and this is my ship. Your weapons will be returned on the way out. You must realize this is just a standard procedure. Don't care. I'm not surrendering my gun. Period. Let them proceed. Our facility is more than secure enough to handle three armed guests. We're bringing Jack out of cryo. As soon as the funds clear, you can be on your way. If you'll follow me to our processing for the pickup, Commander. Let's go. This is going way too smoothly. Something's gonna foobar. Cell block two. As you can see, we keep tight control over the population. I gotta say, I don't get the point of keeping prisoners in cryogenic storage. Each they do that a lot in sci-fi. Self-contained modular unit. I've blown a few out the airlocks as an example. The ship is made up of 30 cell blocks identical to this one. 
we house thousands of criminals. We can put the Plus whole place in lock down a moment's notice. Hi -yo! Nothing goes wrong here. Can you tell me about Jack? Yeah. Cerberus hasn't told you. Jack is the meanest handful of violence and hate I've ever encountered. Dangerous, crazy, and very powerful. You'll see soon enough. How about you? How'd you end up running this ship? I was in law enforcement on Palavin and got sick of seeing criminals escape out into the galaxy to carry on with their crimes. Bounty hunters aren't dependable. Nope. Eventually, I hit upon this idea. Keep the criminals in space, and the galaxy is a safer place. Really? You do this because you think it's necessary? Every day I see the worst sapient life has to offer. Governments are soft, unwilling to make the hard choices. Someone had to stand up and make the galaxy safe. Huh. Maintaining a population this size in space can't be cheap. Yeah. We can cut corners that governments can't. And each prisoner brings in a fee from his home world. Ah. These individuals are violent, and their home planets pay well to keep them here. What happens if the home world doesn't want to pay? We explain that we can't maintain the prisoner without their help. So we'll be forced to release him back onto his home world. Yeah. At an unspecified place and time. Ah. So it's an extortion record. Yep. You don't have to agree with my methods, but don't question my motives. These are despicable people, and I'm keeping them locked up. All right. Let's get on with this. Have there been escape attempts? We're in space. They have nowhere to go, and they know it. But still, we exercise extreme caution. These are dangerous individuals. <laughs> we have many ways to control the population. Sci fi bubble. Confirm that the funds from Cerberus cleared. Our processing is straight down this hallway. Just keep going past the interrogation rooms and the supermax wing. I'll catch up with you later, Shepard. Something is gonna go wrong. This is too easy. Something I can do for you? Whatever he did, he probably deserves worse. He certainly does. Punk! Beat the snot out of him! Hey! Hey guys, over here! Let me ask you something. Sure! If you're buying prisoners, can you buy me? No. Man, I don't care where you take me or what you do to me. It's gotta be better than this. We're here for Jack. Jack? Forget what I just said. I don't want to go nowhere with you. Tell me more about Jack. The worst trouble you ever saw. Mixed with some crazy and way too much biotic power. Neat! That's all I'm saying. I thought this ship was a prison, not a market. Sometimes people buy cons so they can do some punishing of their own, if you understand. Yes. Warden sells this to whoever can pay enough. Why are they interrogating that prisoner? You know something? Nah, that's Bimmy. He don't know nothing. He offed someone in the showers yesterday, I think. The guy he killed was worth a lot to the warden. Yeah. Sucks to be Bimmy right now. I don't care when they stop. They're going at it pretty hard. Do they ever kill prisoners by accident? I haven't heard of anyone dying. Warden can't make money off us if we're dead. Funny thing, though. The more a guard does it, the meaner he gets. So they rotate him through. Mm. What you so, doing? what are you in for? I killed a few people. Only about 20 or so. And I blew up that one habitat. Only. Small time compared to most of the guys here. Dang. What's it like here? Bad. And you gotta watch out. Damn, but someone's always after your stuff. You get Smoke, stuff. Clothes. Your pride. You mean your asshole, right? I haven't taken a shower in three months. Hmm. Sucks to be I you. Go. Wish I could go. Yeah, well, I'm a freaking specter, so that means I can do anything. Hi! Hi. I hear the screaming in my head. It's nice. Yeah. Shoot him in the face! Hmm. That looks to be the way forward, but I want to see what's over here. Ah, it looks like it'll be a couple guards saying you can't go this way. 
Hi, this is the Supermax wing. It's off limits. Our processing is back down the hall on your right. They'll bring your package there after the cryo thaw is finished. But anyway, so like I was saying, um, cryogenically freezing prisoners doesn't make a whole heck of a lot of sense. Why? I mean, really? Our processing is through the door on the far side of the room. Why, why would you do this? I'm waiting for an explosion to happen any minute now. But, um, you know, isn't the whole point of prison to rehabilitate the person, or at least, you know, punish them? If you're cryogenically frozen, you're not even aware. And it depends. Is, are they cryogenically frozen for a spe specific amount of time? Because if it's unlimited, why not just kill them? I don't know. It just doesn't make any sense to me. My apologies, Shepard. You're more valuable as a prisoner than a customer. Saw it coming! Drop your weapons and proceed into this open cell. You will not be harmed. You talked up your noble intentions with this prison, but it turns out you're a criminal like the rest. Mm -hmm. Activate systems! Look out! I want to you This should slow him down. One more. Boom! Oh, I like this upgrade. What are you? Yes! What's the matter? You butt hurt about all the blue suns that I've killed? Monster kill, kill, kill. Okay, enough on real tournament. We need to get Jack out of cryo. Act, act, act. Look out! In a face! In a face! Max. And fuck the blue suns. Bitch! Ow, 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 Jesus. Ow. Oh, hello. Hey, you dude, get your asses in here. So, uh, let's find Jack. If we hack that control, every door on the cell block opens. It's the only way to get Jack out of cryo. I'm doing it. Be ready. Can we use that giant arm to destroy the robots? No, of course not. Wait, that's a woman. That's Jack. Jack's a woman? A woman covered in tattoos. Oh, this is gonna be epic. Do something awesome. Come on, do something awesome. Yeah, like that. Hundred credits. Oh, oh, that's right. I upgraded my med gel capacity. Warning, warning. Sounds like heavy fight. She punched through a wall. 
Holy crap! <laughs> this is valuable. Anything else around here? No. She blasted order. through a wall! Grenades! Sister seven, nine, Money! Eleven have lost life support. No survivors. Glad I got my helmet on. She punched through another wall! Find another exit route. You've got the fucking schematics. Warning. Power plant damage has led to overload. Ooh, shotgun. Systems failure imminent. This guard got swarmed by prisoners with improvised weapons. He never had a chance. Sucks be him. These prisoners are. I don't know what they do here. Lockdown in box four, seven, and eight. Under credits. Oh, wait, cryo rounds. Um, Rio? Is that cool? I don't speak Spanish. What less to worry about? Not all of them? Seems to me. Sucks to be them! Bow, bow, pew, 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 pew. Oh, I've got <clears throat> there you are. Wait no! Oh, I'm still firing cryo rounds. Neat. I didn't think it would last that long. You feel about Fuego? And some more. Oh, wait. Where did I get more grenades? I don't know, but I ain't complaining. Ow. Hey, what happened to the slowdown? Bitch! No, it got him. That all of them? I think it's all of them. Find Jack. Full alert. Find Jack. Money. Now, wasn't there? Didn't they notice a dead prison guard over here too? I'm not sure about that. Yeah, I guess not. I guess it was just that one over there showing up from really far away because that's how this game seems to work. What was that? Oh, All to cell block one. 
Sure, I'm in the middle of a firefight, but I've got enough time to hack a safe. Especially when this fucking easy. Jesus. That was really easy. <laughs> Valuable shepherd. I could have sold you and lived like a king. But you're too much trouble. At least I can recapture Jack. Oh yeah? I think Jack's about to pop up you're behind. You're a slave trader and I don't have time for it. I do the hard things civil governments are unwilling to. This is for the good of the galaxy. Wait, where is he? One more, or no, I missed. Present for you. Oh, you want another? Bitch! Whoa, that was crazy. Punch him in the nuts! Psychic punches! Cerberus. Uh oh. Hi, Jack. You have almost no clothing. What the hell do you want? You're welcome. I just saved your ass. He was already dead. He just didn't know it. Now, what the hell do you want? I'm Shepard. My name is Shepard, and I'm here to get you off this ship. I'm not going anywhere with you. You're Cerberus. <laughs> I'm offering to be your friend. You don't want to be my enemy. They have a way of dying. You show up in a Cerberus frigate to take me away somewhere? You think I'm stupid? Yep. This ship is going down in flames. I've got the only way out. I'm offering to take you with me. And you're arguing. We could just knock her out and take her. I'd like to see you try. Sure. It might just come to that. You'll have to kill me. Look, you want me to come with you? Make it worth my while. Oh, what do you want? Tell me what you're thinking. I bet your ship's got lots of Cerberus databases. I want to look at those files, see what Cerberus has got on me. You want me on your team? Let me go through those databases. Um, okay. <laughs> I'll give you full access. Shepard, you're not authorized to do that. Oh. It upsets the cheerleader even better. You better be straight up with me. No. So why the hell are we standing here? Because you're Move arguing. Up. And the cheerleader has a name. It's Tits McGee. So is it just I, I gain a level every time I do a mission and regular random experience really doesn't have anything to do with anything? All right. We got Jack. Hell yeah, take, up, take steps against the Blue Suns. Like, you know, shooting them every time we find them, which is what we've been doing the whole time. Sweet. Better shotguns. Money. Element zero. Close the fucking report. Ugh. 
Creeping! Welcome to the Normandy, Jack. I'm Miranda, Shepard's second in command. On this ship, we follow orders. Tell the Cerberus cheerleader to back off, Shepard. I'm here because of our deal. You can wait. Get settled in, and I'll give you access soon. Right. Might want to hurry on that. You know the damage I can do inside a frigate? Do I need to put her in the holding cells? Just to be safe? Yeah. No thanks, precious. I'll find my own place, somewhere near the bottom. I don't like through traffic. Don't keep me waiting, Shepard. My eyes are glowing red now. I like it. The scars are glowing, my eyes are glowing. This is cool. I'm liking what being a, being a renegade does. But, um... Uh... Nah, I think it's a good time to end it. Let's just get to the bridge and uh, end the episode. For this... Oh, wait. Let's buy that one tech. Um, yeah, sure. We got... Oh, no, no. Hold on. Do that first. Oh, it takes palladium. Cool. I've got plenty of that. Oh, fine. Not that I ever have anyone around who uses shotguns, but eh. I think that's it aside from the med bay upgrade that I can't afford. Oh, you know what? Fuck it. I've got so much goddamn iridium. What's that called? Element zero? No, you're not getting element zero. Since you're never, ever going on missions with me. Since you're, you know, identical to me, pretty much. Alrighty, uh, this has been your funky onky. Tanky recovered from Corliss indicates stable Krogan life signs inside. It is in the cargo bay. Should you wish to investigate. Thanks for reminding me, because I totally forgot about it. Yeah, um, we'll go do that and talk with Jack and do all sorts of fun stuff in the next one. But this one is over, and this has been your funky onky with Let's Play Mass Effect 2 Blind. Stay tuned for episode, is it, uh, lucky number 13? Where, <laughs> oh, that's a good time to open up the, uh, the Krogan thingy and see what happens. So, uh, yeah, hope you'll see me next time.